And uh, I'd like to say something about the blues. The only thing that kept blues alive from then up until now is the woman. When you play the blues, when you sing and say something they like, they scream. That's why you get your crowd. If you satisfy the women, the men are coming. Whether they like it or not, they're coming because the women are there. And women have always been our background for blues music. And I am happy and I appreciate them very, very much because I know this is true. When I used to go to New York, the Apollo Theater, I'd go in the Teresa Hotel and first time they'd say, oh, you want one of more blues singers, huh? And the women would be, oh, Memphis Slim, man, oh, Memphis Slim. And the guy, I think it was maybe 50% jealousy or something, but they didn't dig it too much. I've got to find my woman. It's one thing, I don't know anything about astrology or anything like that, but I know I'm very positive. I know everything I went after, I got it. I think it's simply that. I've had a lot of, lot of bad luck and a lot of bad things happen to me. And I'm very happy about everything that happened to me because everything that ever happened to me, it conditioned me for life. And I have no ill feeling about anything ever happened to me in my back life. I'm very glad it happened, actually. I'm very happy it happened because I can cope with just about anything that comes along now. So that's, you know, that's the way I see it. I'll tell you one thing. If you never had any bad luck, you don't know what good luck means. You really don't know. I am, uh, I'm very happy. I am content. Now I live in Paris, married with a wife and a daughter. I can still sing the blues. I can sing the blues better now because I'm like a missionary preacher now. Also, in 1977, the United States Senate, along with Senator Hayek Cowan, made me ambassador of goodwill by the United States Congress. And now I go all over the world teaching the blues and being a decent American and a good blues singer and carry myself in a way that America appreciates me and the whole world appreciates me. And I'm very happy for that, and I thank you very much. <laughs>